Flash. We're on Season 1, Episode 19. It's called Who is Harrison Wells? So, guys, I'm looking forward to seeing this next episode. The title of it is, like, Who is Harrison Wells? We already know who he is. He's Irvon Thawne. That's who he is, or at least disguised as him. I don't know if they're going to go through more of his past or something like before, you know, before Irvon Thawne got to him. Uh, but we already know that that Harrison Wells is not him. From the Mercury Lab, the doctor who was there, or uh, the, the lady, uh, she told uh, Barry about him before he, you know, became different. So uh, when she, she said they used to work together really well, they used to have been pretty close, and then suddenly she, they say she just changed. He just changed completely. He just became a different person. That was pretty much after the accident that uh, Harrison Wells had. But we left off with the uh, the last scene where uh, Barry and Joe, you know, brought in uh, Caitlin and Cisco into this, and they, he told them like uh, Harrison Wells is the Reverse Flash. Uh, of course, Caitlin didn't want to believe it, but Cisco, he because he since he had the memories and like the flashbacks, he he already believed it. He already knew. Now they're gonna pretty much investigate this whole thing and work together to figure out if. Harrison Wells is the reverse flash. I don't know when they're gonna find out that he is the reverse flash, but that cannot wait to see the reactions on there. That's gonna be freaking crazy. Other than that, guys, I can't wait to see his next episode. But before this video begins, guys, I want to thank Damon for sponsoring this video through the Patreon page. Make sure you guys go on the Patreon page to support the channel. I appreciate any support that does come around. Anyway, guys, let's get into this next episode for the Flash. Where's Barry? He should be here any second. I sent him out for. Him. Pizza! What? Best in what? the West. Why did I not think of this before? Pizza. Come to Papa. Bo and Cisco are gonna go to Starling City. Starling City? What for? To investigate the car accident that Dr. Wells was in with Tess Morgan 15 years ago. I don't understand. Why? Dr. McGee said that after Wells' accident, he became, like, a complete stranger. Because the love of his life died? You, of all people, can understand how grief can change a person. We have to learn everything we can about that night. See where it leads us. See you tomorrow. Night. This is you on the surveillance footage, correct? It looks like me. It's not me. I left work early yesterday. Ask my husband. Which doesn't lie. Your husband might. I recently inherited the entire collection. Beautiful. That's him, is it? Let me grab my microscope. 911 emergency. This is Dominic over at Abbott Jewelers. I've got a guy in here trying to sell stolen diamonds. If and before I can believe any of this, I'm going to need to see some proof. Proof? Proof of what? Uh, uh, we may have another metahuman case on our hands. Have you heard from Cisco? He hasn't arrived yet. Uh, he has to help Dante, his brother. Eddie. Hey, I got a call about a guy selling some of the jewelry stolen from the bank last night. There he is. I think he's made me. You can't outrun me. I won't have to. Disguise? He can disguise a shapeshifter. Yeah, like, I literally saw a grown man like morph into a teenage girl. There it is. This is all you have. Well, that's a pretty cut and dry case, Detective. So, uh, Joe and Quentin. what are you two hoping to find? Not exactly sure yet. You come all the way from Central City. You don't know what you're looking for. Just following a hunch. Uh, can you take us to the accident site? I need those witness statements for the Joshua Brown trial. All right, uh, Detective West, Cisco Ramon. This is ADA Laurel Lads. What? Related. Daughter. Hey. Hey there. You work at Star Labs with Barry Allen. Yeah. Can I talk to you privately for a minute? Sure. Let's go. I know Barry's the Flash and Oliver's the Arrow. <laughs> you know that. <laughs> because I'm the Black Canary. I'll play. True. You stop it right now. Ah. Uh, no. <laughs> Look at that. I need some technical expertise. Seeing my sister's sonic device. Hoping you could help modify it. I think I've got some ideas. Why are you going there, Caitlin? Get pranked. <laughs> Good job. What were you doing at Wells' house? I, I was gonna talk to him and get some answers of my own. You cannot talk to him. Heard from your grandson Hannibal recently, Mrs. Bates? Recently? Uh-huh. No, why do you ask? Because uh, you filed a missing persons report? My memory is not quite as it used to be. Of course. You are like apparently on oh, my manners. I get you to something. Coffee would be nice. Would you happen to have a recent photograph of Hannibal? Ma'am? She's in all this issue. She's gone. I'll take the front. <laughs> What do you want us to do, Thought? Die. No! It's gonna be... It's on camera! 
Bruh! He framed him. No! Ah, oh, this looks so bad. Looks like one of your detectives shot two of your cops, both of whom are now fighting for their lives. That's not what happened. Can't ignore what I just watched because you want me to. So it must be interesting having a daughter who's also the DA. <laughs> yeah, interesting. So we have a bit of a rough patch. Yeah, she uh, she kept some from me, you know, something important. Lied to me about it for months. Sometimes we lie for love, especially when it comes to family, right? Joe. Yeah. I think we got something. Achions, little bits of time travel. You sure? Pretty sure, yeah. Right, that video is pretty damning. No. No, we just have to convince her. Seeing is believing, Barry. Okay, look. You get to Star Labs, I'll set you up with a burner phone. I'll contact... No, when your dad was put away, you were a kid. There wasn't anything you could do. But you're not a kid anymore. You're a scientist. You are gonna find Bates, and you are gonna clear me. I promise, Iris, where I'm gonna get Eddie out of this, okay? Eddie? What in the world? How did you get out? That's not I him! I'm the favor. But a judge to sign my release. I was just on the phone with Iris. Why haven't you called her? <laughs> no, you, come on. I have no idea who she is. Oh, my lord. Gary, it's me. Hello. You? Figured out a way to stop our shapeshifter from morphing into other people. Go back to Star Labs. Figure out how to catch this every man. Of course, let's go. Please tell me that's not what I think it is. Hey, that is definitely a hand. See, I thought it was a foot, but a hand is just as bad. Is that Harris? Yeah, I'm gonna have to call this one in. I can't let you do that. I forget you ever saw it. Wes, I can't do it. Listen, Lance, if this is who I think it is, anybody that knows about this is in a hell of a lot of danger. The theorem that you're making, is it a temporary fix, or will it take away his power? Not permanently, just long enough so we can stop it. Something I think I should have done. No! A long what are you, time ago. What are you doing? Barry, I... What? Oh, my God. Look who's here. I hacked into my dad's CCPD account and went through the footage of Eddie shooting those cops. Die. Oh, it seems pretty convincing to me. Look again. Eddie is not left-handed. Look, Eddie is being framed, and we need to figure out who is behind this. Believe me, when I get my hands on them, they are going to be... What did you do? Your observations about the shooter were spot on. He was indeed left-handed, as is this man. Our Barry is right-handed. Oh, I knew it. Oh! Never mind. It might be best if Dr. Snow and I handled this. Hmm. What are you two going to do? No, 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 no. I I I'm taking him in. So dumb. You know who else was in that file? The Burning Man. Really? What about it? I thought it was just some urban legend. Help me! Help me! Help me! Help me! Oh, no. Get out here. I need help! I need help! Please, 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 please. Call the police! No! No! Oh, She's my dangerous! God. I hey! She's dangerous! Oh, Barry. Mm. <laughs> Let's go. Laurel, hey. Uh, we're just about to head back to Central City. For you able to make that item? I think this will do the trick. Put around her neck. Be able to do some serious damage with this thing. As promised. Show this to anyone, I'll kill you. <laughs> it's just an expression. Aww. I've made a serum that will create a cortical reaction around his cells. You deprive those cells of their electrical charge? Oh, that's great work. <laughs> Thank you. Um, no need for... A hug or anything like that. Are we sure he's at the airport? According to the GPS on your phone, he's there. There he, there he is. Gotcha. Hannibal Bates! I think you've mistaken me for someone else. Wait, it's me. Oh, come on, Barry. That's me. Read all your women like that. That on the flash. You you look like me. You're done imitating innocent people. Ah! Yeah. The one and only. The charge has been dropped. I'm clear to go. Let me out of here! There's been a lot of things that you can become, but who are you? I, uh, I can't remember. Oh, let's lock up shop. Good night, everyone. 
Oh, freaking alien. This is impossible. Keelan, I ran the DNA test twice. This body is the real Harrison Wells. If this is Dr. Wells, then who have Whoa. we been working for this whole time? Dr. McGee said that after the accident, Wells became a completely different person. It's because he is a different person. Dr. Wells, your own business? I came to give my regards to Detective Thawne. Glad it all worked out. Did you enjoy your time in Starling City? Not much time for sightseeing. You used to live there. I did. You ever go back? No. Too many memories of Tess. We should have another drink sometime. He could tell. He could tell he's a different guy. Big building. Lots of places for Wells to hide something. What is Whoa. that? That shouldn't be there. Rudy. No, they're gonna find it. Right here. They're gonna find it. What the frick? <laughs> oh my god, they freaking discovered the room for where uh Yervon Thon usually stays at for a minute to talk to Gideon. they obviously I'm pretty sure the next episode they're gonna talk to her. But since they went through through the door, I'm pretty sure you're, you know Thon's gonna know. He's definitely gonna know now. And how was uh Barry able to open that? I thought it was like a finger scan for you know only for uh, Irvon Thon's hand. That's kind of weird how it just opened up right for him. It was pretty crazy how when, you know, Quentin and Joe and Cisco went to find the real Harrison, or at least look at the site where Harrison Wells so-called had the crash and, you know, his uh, his wife died. They found his real body. They found the body and now they know for sure that this guy is not the real Harrison Wells now. So now they know. So now they got to just get the truth out of him and it's gonna be crazy, man. I can't wait to see the next episode, see what's gonna happen. This is gonna be really, really interesting to see. And the guy that can change into like pretty much anyone, man, he looked, he looked like a damn alien. Like, what the hell? He can't even open his eyes. Uh, but I'm just glad they locked him up because he's dangerous. He's super dangerous. Other than that, guys, I can't wait to see this next episode. But please post your comments down below. Tell me what you think about this awesome episode for the Flash. Make sure you guys go on the Patreon page to get the full reaction on there and also support the channel as well. Anyway, guys, hope you guys have a wonderful day. I'll see you guys in the next Flash.